Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel, Canada Immigration. We hope you're doing great. Well, in this, we'll talk about Canada PNP without job offer 2024. Welcome, aspirants, to an exploration of boundless opportunities in the realm of Canadian immigration. In 2024, Canada stands as an ideal destination for those seeking to enhance their lives across various dimensions financial, educational, professional, and social. In this journey, we shine a spotlight on the Provincial Nominee Program PNP, without a job offer, unraveling the pathways that lead to a promising future in the Great White North. As we delve into the intricacies of PNP programs across provinces, each with its unique charm and requirements, we invite you to discover the potential that awaits. Whether you're a skilled professional, a tech enthusiast, or someone with diverse talents, Canada's PNP Without Job Offers provides a gateway to realizing your Canadian dreams. Join us on this informative voyage through the landscape of PNP opportunities in 2024. So, to get all the information, pay attention and watch the video through to the end please hit like and subscribe, and don't forget to push the notification bell for upcoming episodes. So, without any further delay, let's jump into the video. Canada stands as an aspirational destination for those seeking to enhance their financial, educational, health, professional, and social prospects. Renowned for its welcoming approach to immigrants and skilled foreign workers, Canada offers entry through various immigration pathways, with the Express Entry program being the most popular. However, for those without a job offer, a promising alternative is the Canada Provincial Nominee Program PNP. Securing a PNP nomination can provide a strategic advantage within the Express Entry system, significantly improving the chances of obtaining a Canada Permanent Residence Visa. Introduction to Canada PNP Without Job Offer the Canada Provincial Nominee Program PNP, serves as an excellent immigration gateway for aspirants navigating the immigration landscape without a job offer. Notably, certain Canadian provinces extend invitations to immigrants even without a job offer. With a straightforward application process and clear documentation steps, the Canada PNP without a job offer is an accessible pathway for prospective immigrants. Selection Procedure for Canada PNP Without Job Offer 2024 the Canadian Immigration Program is intricately designed to address the gap between employer demands and available human resources. Aligned with market and employment demands in the Canadian economy, the Canada PNP aims to overcome challenges faced by Canadian employers in sourcing skilled manpower for various industries and occupations. The program facilitates the entry of foreign skilled workers into specific Canadian provinces, each having its own set of immigration rules aligned with the National Occupation Classification NOC, code which categorizes jobs under Canada's official job classification system. Five Canadian provinces stand out by offering immigration opportunities to applicants without a valid job offer. Saskatchewan Immigrant Nominee Program SINP. Subcategories Occupation and Demand Express Entry Known for its prominence in grain farming and abundant natural resources like rivers and freshwater lakes, Saskatchewan is the world's largest producer of potash chemical. Nicknamed the Land of Living Skies, Saskatchewan has a population of over 1.1 million, with its capital, Regina, exemplifying a modern outlook and a welcoming attitude towards immigrants and their diverse backgrounds. The province actively seeks ideal candidates and skilled workers willing to contribute to its modern industries, facilities, and the broader Canadian economy. Eligibility Criteria for SIN Occupation in Demand and Express Entry Subcategories Willingness to Work in Modern Industries Contribution to the Canadian Economy with Skills and Talent Quebec Skilled Worker Program QSWP Details Pending Nova Scotia Nominee Program NSNP Details Pending Alberta PNP Through Express Entry Details Pending Prince Edward Island PNP Through Express Entry Details Pending Ontario Immigration Nominee Program OINP Details Pending Benefits of Canada PNP Without Job Offer Candidates who meet the eligibility criteria and immigration rules for their chosen province can receive a nomination, securing an additional 600 points on the Comprehensive Ranking System CRS, scale. This not only strengthens their express entry profile but also paves the way for a smoother and hassle-free process to obtain a permanent residence PR, visa. Canada, known for its inclusive immigration policies, provides diverse pathways for individuals to become permanent residents. Among these, Provincial Nominee Programs PNP, offer a promising route for immigrants without a job offer. In this comprehensive guide, we delve into the eligibility criteria and requirements for PNP programs in Saskatchewan, Nova Scotia, and Quebec, 
shedding light on the opportunities they present for aspiring immigrants. Saskatchewan Immigrant Nominee Program SINP, a gateway to the prairies. Saskatchewan, with its vast prairies and thriving economy, welcomes skilled workers through the Saskatchewan Immigrant Nominee Program SINP. This program, particularly through the Express Entry Stream, opens avenues for immigrants without a job offer to settle in the province. Eligibility Criteria Identity Proof and Legal Resident Status Applicants must provide legal documents validating their resident status. IELTS Proficiency Minimum 5 bands in each category, reading, writing, speaking, and listening, in the IELTS test are required to demonstrate English proficiency. Education and Training at least one year of education and training equivalent to the Canadian academic system is necessary. Work experience, a minimum of one year of work experience in the last 10 years related to a specific field or skilled occupation, NOC 0, A, or B. Professional license, proof of professional operation in Saskatchewan, such as a valid license. Financial stability, applicants must showcase enough funds to settle in Saskatchewan. Point system, a minimum of 60 points out of 100 in the provincial point grade system is required. Aspirants can check their eligibility using the Saskatchewan Immigration Points Calculator. Express Entry Connection Notably, the Synth through Express Entry is only available to applicants with an Express Entry profile and an ongoing Saskatchewan Occupation in Demand application. Benefits Successful candidates receive an additional 600 points on the Comprehensive Ranking System CRS in the Express Entry Pool, enhancing their chances of obtaining a permanent residence PR, visa. Nova Scotia Nominee Program NSNP, Sailing Towards Opportunities Nova Scotia, known as New Scotland, is a picturesque province and a major seaport in Canada. The Nova Scotia Nominee Program NSNP, offers the Labour Priorities Stream, enabling immigrants without a job offer to make this maritime province their home. Eligibility Criteria Express Entry Number Applicants should have a valid express entry number with an intention to move to Nova Scotia. Letter of interest, receipt of a letter of interest from the Nova Scotia province is essential. Age requirement, aspirants must be in the age bracket of 18 to 49 years. IELTS or CLB score, minimum scores in IELTS or Canadian language benchmark, CLB, are required. Work experience, meet the work experience requirements in a specific field. Education credentials, educational credentials equivalent to Canadian academic standards are necessary. Proof of funds, applicants must meet the proof of funds criterion. Quebec Skilled Worker Program, QSWP, the French Connection. Quebec, the second most populated province in Canada, boasts a unique cultural identity with French as its official language. The Quebec Skilled Worker Program, QSWP, allows immigrants without a job offer to contribute to the province's diverse economy. Eligibility Criteria, Identity Proof and Legal Resident Status Applicants need valid identity proof and legal documents confirming their resident status. IELTS Proficiency, Minimum 4 bands in each category, Reading, Writing, Speaking, and Listening, in the IELTS test demonstrate English proficiency. Education and Training, At least one year of education and training equivalent to the Canadian academic system is required. Work experience, a minimum of one year of work experience in the last 10 years related to a specific field or skilled occupation, NOC 0, A, or B. Professional license, proof of professional operation in Quebec, often requiring a license. Financial stability, applicants must showcase enough funds to settle in Quebec. Point system, a minimum of 60 points out of 100 in the provincial point grade system, often assessed through the Quebec Immigration Points Calculator. French language proficiency, Proficiency or knowledge of the French language can significantly contribute to a higher score. Expression of interest, EOI, interested applicants should submit an expression of interest, EOI, through the online ARIMA portal for QSWP. Benefits, a higher score, often influenced by French language proficiency, contributes to a competitive advantage in the selection process. Alberta and Prince Edward Island PNP through Express Entry. Canada, with its diverse provinces and territories stands as an inviting land of opportunities for immigrants seeking a new life. In this comprehensive guide, we explore the Provincial Nominee Programs PNP, in Alberta and Prince Edward Island PEI, through the Express Entry System, shedding light on eligibility criteria, benefits, and the pathways these provinces offer to immigrants without a job offer. Alberta PNP through Express Entry, a gateway to prosperity. Named after Princess Louise Caroline Alberta, the fourth daughter of Queen Victoria, Alberta is Canada's fourth most populated province. 
nestled between British Columbia, Saskatchewan, and the Northwest Territories. Alberta boasts a robust economy driven by the supply and service of crude oil, sand, and other resources. Edmonton, the provincial capital, plays a pivotal role in supporting these industries. Alberta's natural beauty, represented by destinations like Banff, Jasper, Lake Louise, Drumheller, Canmore, and Sylvan Lake, adds to its lure. Eligibility Criteria Identity proof and legal resident status, applicants need to provide valid identity proof and legal documents validating their resident status. IELTS proficiency, minimum 5 bands in each category, reading, writing, speaking, and listening, in the IELTS test showcase English proficiency. Education and training, at least one year of education and training equivalent to the Canadian academic system is required. Professional license, proof of professional operation in Alberta, often requiring a valid license. Financial stability, applicants must demonstrate enough funds to settle in Alberta. CRS score and points system, candidates with a comprehensive ranking system, CRS, score of 300 plus have bright chances of selection. Those with 67 points out of 100 in the provincial point grade system and a CRS score of 300 plus are likely to be picked by provincial authorities. Opportunities, Alberta's Express Entry Program doesn't have a specific occupation list, allowing skilled workers from various backgrounds to apply. Prince Edward Island PNP through Express Entry, Embracing Diversity. Known as the Garden of the Gulf, the birthplace of Confederation, or the Cradle of Confederation, Prince Edward Island PEI, is Canada's smallest province in terms of land area and population. Despite its size, Pei boasts a diverse population and a thriving economy dependent on agriculture, potato farming, fisheries, modern industries, renewable energy, and tourism. The provincial capital, Charlottetown, stands as a symbol of cultural richness, welcoming individuals from various nationalities. Eligibility Criteria Identity Proof and Legal Resident Status Valid Identity Proof and Legal Documents Validating Resident Status are prerequisites. IELTS Proficiency Minimum 5 bands in each category, reading, writing, speaking, and listening, in the IELTS test demonstrate English proficiency. Education and Training at least one year of education and training equivalent to the Canadian academic system is necessary. Professional license, proof of professional operation in Prince Edward Island, often requiring a valid license. Financial stability, demonstrating enough funds to settle in Prince Edward Island is a key criterion. CRS score and points system, candidates with a CRS score of 300 plus have good chances of selection. Those with 67 points out of 100 in the provincial point grade system and a CRS score of 300 plus are likely to be picked by provincial authorities. Opportunities, Pays Express Entry Stream considers applicants with an online profile in the Express Entry Pool, provided they are eligible for one of the Federal Economic Immigration Classes, Ontario Immigration Nominee Program, OINP. The Ontario Immigration Nominee Program, OINP, stands as a beacon for individuals aspiring to migrate without a job offer particularly through its Human Capital Priorities HCP, stream. This pathway opens avenues for skilled workers, aligning with the province's economic needs and welcoming individuals to contribute to Ontario's diverse and dynamic communities. Human Capital Priorities stream, a gateway without job offer. The Human Capital Priorities stream of the OINP serves as a catalyst for express entry candidates, offering three express entry linked categories. Moreover, the OINP strategically uses the HCP stream to conduct tech draws for candidates with work experience in six tech sector occupations. Notably, a job offer is not a prerequisite for consideration, but applicants must have an active express entry profile and substantial work experience. Minimum Eligibility Requirements For candidates venturing into the Ontario Immigrant Nominee Program OINP, Human Capital Priorities Stream, several minimum eligibility criteria pave the way for a seamless application process skilled program requirements. Applicants must meet the requirements of skilled programs such as the Federal Skilled Worker Program FSWP, or Canadian Experience Class CEC. This involves showcasing relevant skills and qualifications. Work experience, fulfilling the work experience requirements of the specific stream is essential. Candidates need to demonstrate a track record of professional experience aligning with the stream they are applying through. Educational Credential Assessment ECA. An Educational Credential Assessment ECA, report by a designated organization is a mandatory component, ensuring that the applicant's educational qualifications meet the Canadian standards. Language Proficiency, a proficiency level of Canadian Language Benchmark CLB, 
7 or above in all four language sections, reading, writing, speaking, and listening, is a key criterion, reflecting the applicant's ability to communicate effectively in English or French. Desire to reside in Ontario? Applicants are required to express a genuine desire to reside in Ontario by signing an intent, emphasizing their commitment to contributing to the province. Minimum CRS score, meeting the minimum comprehensive ranking system, CRS, score under the express entry system is crucial. This score is a comprehensive evaluation of factors like age, education, work experience, and language proficiency. Proof of funds, providing sufficient proof of funds is a vital requirement, ensuring that applicants have the financial means to settle in Ontario and support themselves upon arrival. Frequently asked questions, navigating the PNP landscape. As individuals embark on their journey through the Provincial Nominee Program PNP, landscape, questions inevitably arise. Here are answers to common queries that shed light on the intricacies of the PNP application process without a job offer. What is the Provincial Nominee Program? PNP? The Provincial Nominee Program is a Canadian immigration pathway that allows provinces and territories to nominate individuals who can contribute to their local economy and community. How do I apply for PNP Canada without a job offer? Each province or territory has its own PNP streams, some of which do not require a job offer. Research and identify the province aligning with your skills, then apply to their PNP stream catering to candidates without a job offer. What are the basic requirements for PNP Canada without a job offer? Requirements vary, encompassing factors like education, work experience, language proficiency, and adaptability. Thorough research is essential as provinces may have specific criteria. Can I apply for permanent residency through PNP without a job offer? Yes, successful nomination through a PNP stream often leads to an invitation to apply for permanent residency from the federal government. However, additional steps and requirements may be involved. How long does the PNP application process take without a job offer? Processing times vary by province, stream, and other factors. Checking the respective province's official website for up-to-date information on processing times is recommended. Can I include my family members in my PNP application without a job offer? Yes, many PNP streams allow inclusion of your spouse or common-law partner and dependent children. They can also be nominated for permanent residency if your application is successful. Conclusion, charting a course to Ontario and beyond. In conclusion, the Ontario Immigration Nominee Program OINP, Human Capital Priorities Stream serves as a navigational guide for skilled individuals seeking opportunities in Ontario without the need for a job offer. The minimum eligibility requirements outlined ensure that applicants possess the essential attributes to contribute meaningfully to Ontario's economic and cultural landscape. As applicants explore the Provincial Nominee Program PNP, landscape, a wealth of opportunities unfolds, each province offering a unique pathway to Canadian dreams. Whether it's the vibrant tech sector draws of Ontario or the diverse landscapes of other provinces, the PNP landscape beckons, embracing newcomers and enriching the Canadian tapestry. Your pathway to a new chapter in Canada awaits. As we conclude our exploration into Canada's PNP without job offer landscape in 2024, we trust that this journey has illuminated the diverse avenues available for those aspiring to call Canada home. The provincial nominee programs, designed to bridge the gap between local needs and global talent, offer a unique entry point for individuals without a job offer. Thank you for joining us in this exploration of the Canada Provincial Nominee Program for 2024. We hope this guide has been informative and has equipped you with the knowledge you need to embark on your immigration journey to Canada without a job offer. Remember, the PNP is a dynamic program with evolving criteria, so always check for the latest updates from the official sources. If you found this information helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more updates on immigration, visas, and life in Canada. Wishing you the best on your path to a new life in the Great White North. That is all for today, in this video. What are your thoughts on this? Please let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching the entire video. Hopefully, the information is useful to you. See you later, in the next episode. Till then, take care.